Today, we cut the DN to 5 O single sphere, rubber joint as a sample. Today, let me explain to you why our matching flanges use small diameter flanges. Over the years, many customers have chosen to purchase our small diameter counter flanges. For example, DN to 5 O, its inner diameter is 250 millimeters. You see, the place where our rubber joint exerts its strength and plays a sealing role is the tooth of the slotted flange. The place where this tooth pushes up with force is firmly pressed, which is where my pencil points. There will be no problem. The inner diameter of the rubber ball and the flange is only 2 millimeters, which is a perfect match. Let's look at another wrong example. The inner diameter of the flange used on the construction site is very large. The inner diameter of DN to 5O reaches to 70 to 80 mm, and this one is almost 280 mm. If you look closely at this slotted flange, you will see that when you push up on this place, where you apply force, it becomes empty. After this happens, the rubber joint can easily tear and come off the ring. This will easily cause water leakage. You can see that the inner wall of the rubber has been deformed. There is about a 10 millimeters gap between the rubber and the flange. The bottom has been pressed in and the top has bulged. The final result is like this rubber ball. Over time, under high pressure, the rubber ring will tear.